Hello ladies and gentlemen, it is Rec Plays Sonic Generations, and uh, I had a small recording problem that I've kind of got to apologize for before we get in here. Um, basically what happened was I went to go to Seaside Hill, and for some reason, it really didn't enjoy recording Seaside Hill, so I went through it once, and then I accidentally saved this guy but we're gonna play through it again and hopefully that won't happen again it was pretty it was pretty annoying it was bad anyway um, I'll do all the cutscenes because I've got them saved but yeah here we go Seaside Hill this is from Sonic Heroes which was the game that came out after Sonic Adventure 2 um, I didn't spend a lot of time with it but I think Seaside Hill was one of the demo levels and it was originally intended for Team Sonic which was a combination of Sonic, Knuckles, and Tails. And this is a very happy little level. With a lot of neat and interesting mechanics all to itself. So let's blaze on through here. A lot of loop-de-loops and a lot of sort of sea parkish ventures. Another thing I did was I turned off the reflection graphics to provide a little bit of a smoother experience. Oh, that's another thing. Um, they, this level introduces the wall jump mechanic, which is pretty simple enough to understand. All you have to do is jump when you hit a wall. That is quite literally it. Um, and past that, there's not really much to say about it. It's a pretty level, though. I like this level. Glad I finally got the hang of doing these freaking combos. All right. Continuing forward. Dolphins, 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 dolphins. Oh, oh. I don't know why I said dolphins when those were killing kills, but hey, I'm not a marine biologist, so you can't really blame me, can ya? No! Like a second too early. Oh, it's going so good. And I was like ready to S rank this level, if not for that little F up. Alright, whatever. Uh, left, right, right, left, okay. Better. Also, I think I fixed the frame rate problem I was having, or most of it anyway, which is good. Because that was getting annoying as well. Uh, whoa! Okay. There we go. These little things like to put up electric fields and make me mad. Now I don't have any rings! I'm gonna have to be very careful about this part. Darn it. Nope. You're not allowed to just poke me with your thing. Don't poke me with your thing. I don't need to be poked with your thing. I'm allergic to the poking with the thing. Okay, this is another weird part. You can either go the slow route or the fast route, so I'm gonna try to time it. Fast route! Yeah, there we go. Fast route's a lot more fun. Because you get to do a little bit of kart racing. Oh boy! Kart racing! Wait! I'm not even sure if this was in the original level or not. Probably was. No special controls, pretty much. I think this is just a little bit faster than using regular Sonic. We Drift! Drift, you crazy hedgehog! Okay, there we go. Think we about got it. Missed another red coin. I don't care because I'm not collecting them anyway. It doesn't matter to me. Yep. 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 Oh god! Almost screwed that part up, but I didn't, and I'm still going. Momentum. 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 Okay, I'm doing this one. Okay, this runs a lot better than the last one. That's good. Last run I was having a lot of issues. Mostly it was because of the frame rate messing up. This game is almost, almost too much for my computer. Because it moves very fast and the backgrounds are very detailed. Oh, crap. Close. Very close to hitting the high road there. And then we have giant spinny barrels of doom. Hopefully none of them will hit me. 
Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! Wow! That was close, and then I missed. Okay. That's good. I'm guessing I had an A rank, yeah. I made really good time. If I hadn't died that one time, it would have been perfect. But, beggars can't be choosers. So there's that level done. Uh, let's switch over to Classic Sonic and do it on him. The Classic Sonic version of this level is a lot more, uh, a lot less, rather, uh, gimmicky. It's a lot easier, but this time I'm not going to make the mistake of using my Bubble Shield when I shouldn't be doing that. The bubble Shield's very good for getting to places that you wouldn't normally be able to get to, and also emergencies. So, I'm just gonna hang on to it until I'm pretty sure I need it. Also, spikes are really annoying on the classic Sonic version of this. They're like all over the place. No, I'm not gonna run out of breath. But I am gonna hit by spikes again, because they're all over the place and I hate them. Hate spikes, hate you. Nope, no love. No love. Whoa. There we go. I'm out. I'm hoping I didn't go down when I should have gone up. This is a way I haven't really been before either. Okay, now this is gonna be a jet stream part, I think. These were in, I think, the second Sonic game. But I don't remember completely. But it's easy enough to understand. You're just forced on the current, and you've gotta grab onto little bars. Let's see. Jump. I'm it. There we go. And we're out. I keep thinking I'm doing the modern version of this. Cannon! Bitches love cannons. Oh, I had to make the reference. I was thinking about it earlier. I was like, I'm not sure I want to make that reference or not. Yeah, yeah. I'll make the reference. Helsing Bridge to everyone. You should be watching it. It's good. It only updates once a year, but it's good. Takahata, all my love. Okay, let's go now up the thing. There we go. Getting to the easier portion, I think. The inner. The inside with all the jet streams and stuff isn't my favorite part. But I've done a good job of not dying so far. Watch that jinx me. Oh! Oh! Hey, oh! Nice. Nice, 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 nice. I love the whales! Whales are so happy! Man, it's been a while since I've been to SeaWorld. I don't know why, I just kind of brought that up, but, uh, okay, let's be careful. Come on, get over there. There we go. Good job. Good job. Good job. Yeah, I didn't notice that before. There's a regular theme of three different branching paths that are very close together. Now, here's what I was talking about, the jet stream thing. Whoop. 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 And avoid that. Thank you. I didn't catch the breath. I might have need. No, I didn't. Okay. We're good. We're set. And giant barrel attack. Ah! Oh! Get away from me, you disastrous thing. That's gonna start rolling all slow. You thought the truck was bad. This thing's worse. Like, this is a very adamant circular object. <laughs> Follow me through the curves. There we go. All right, that's done. Seaside Hill, everybody. It was fun. A little bit annoying because um, sometimes you can hit things at the wrong angle when you're playing it during the modern 
rendition and it will send you flying off into the water at random and that can get frustrating but uh hey oh by the way this is ninja man and ninja man is who we rescued in this level and eh da 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 Basically, when you rescue him, he says, I am a ninja, lol, I am purple, lol, thank you for lolling, lol, me. Rescue, rescue me, rescue me. But, I will treat you to your cutscene! I've just gotta run back and get to it, just give me a second. Movies, there we go. together more of what's happening and it's not good mm, giant flying space monster I'm pretty sure uh, everything's just fine I don't know what you're talking about goes through time it tears space apart leaving the areas empty and dead and sticking them in this weird white limbo when the sonics accelerate through time they fix space returning color and life Then I guess we have to run like there's no tomorrow, or there won't be a tomorrow. Yeah, the plot really isn't the high point of this game. <laughs> it, it's it's not it's not for the plot. It's it's for the level design. Let's be honest here. But anyway, now that that's done, we have to go do all of our all of our challenge crap. So let's get on with it. <laughs> 